Good morning and welcome to the Cosmopolitan Mix. A big thank you to the Super Morning Show team, Daniel Dadzi and uh, Enimo Enimadu and the rest of them bringing us uh, your preferred morning show, the Super Morning Show right here on Joy 99.7. Make a day with them same time tomorrow morning. Well, thanks for making me your part of uh, part of your mid-morning. We're here to serve you the best brunch in the capital and beyond. It's the Cosmopolitan Mix, probably produced by Philip Knight. Yes, yes, yes. We're going till midday, and I have uh, a special couple right here in the studio. I'll let you in on a bit. Look forward to uh, the Lifestyle Cafe brought to us courtesy Acacia. We place value on those you value, as well as OnePlex 400, your one-stop dilemma for the entire family. Guess what we're talking about on the Lifestyle Cafe this morning? I'll be giving you signs that you can actually pay attention to when you want to find out if your boss is hitting on you. Now that's for the ladies this morning. Cosmopolitan Mix, you can interrupt that's via WhatsApp 0244340437. We're live on Facebook as well. Get on there and check out my guests in the studio. Let me quickly introduce them with this particular song. The Cosmopolitan Cosmopolitan AMG baby Me living my life so smooth young boy I know they see nobody I they live like a damn my boy Every day I for make that money I they live like I'm from Takrade Baby, I'm a messiah day. My question is, my dina boy, it's mente. I saw my nini, my forte, my se. Me pa me brass, se kuma se boy. And also wah. They treat me kakra, me paya boy. And also wah. I dey ball like a drain of gay. And also wah. Cause we a boy, I'm okay. And also wah. It no be muff. I know they up. Bridge gangin'. Me ma me a talk. If you forget everybody want it, I was in the type of time. My jeans in my bra mo. Never try touch man them. Too risky. The anthem too risky. I feel make it rain on them too risky. Before I put the blame on them too risky. Never try touch man them too risky. Poof poof be the anthem too risky. I feel make it rain on them too risky. Before I put the blame on them too risky. Uh, I saw by my first car. Them try think far. So I buy another one. With the Holy Ghost far. Post stop sign for my body. You can't see the boy, I am so far gone. Way a real talk, mean cow toli. May come any mean poly. At your age, tell me what you get. I mean the shiny pad, don't forget. You forget some goodie for pocket. But you mean jinami and they're all correct. You make a let. Mim pie bar and say many be na mama will be when you be a mammy be I know they act smart. I'll be mixed out of a son and lamuji. The anthem too risky. I feel make it rain on them too risky. Before I put the blame on them too risky. Never try touch man them too risky. Poof poof be the anthem too risky. I feel make it rain on them too risky. Before I put the blame on them too risky. Make you hit your chest like too risky. Cough as your party who is she? Move briskly cause I'm too frisky. Drink one calico two biscuits. Some they think say I be too known, but money on my mind, so I day in my zone. You know, help me make up now. It be too risky to give you a loan. I they live like a day London. I they live like a day London. Joy, rocking at the dash on John. Rocking at the dash on John. And I'm sure by now you have an idea of who my guests are this morning. Uh, don't forget the hashtag on uh, Twitter is the Cosmopolitan Mix. I have Medical and Sister Derby in the studios. Good morning. Swag, swag, um, swag. Well, how, how do I refer to you, Mr. and Mrs.? <laughs> hey, Medical and Sister Derby. Was this our... Great, great to see you guys. <laughs> it's, it's been a while. It's been a while we were actually hooked up. Uh, Medical, how are you doing, man? I'm chilling, Charlie. Uh, I'm chilling. I see. Sister Derby, I, I love your glasses, by the way. Thank I've been you. saying, she looks like Lady Gaga this week. Don't mind. Looks like I'm the one who's left out. Charlie <laughs> Philip, I beg, give me some Googles. Eh? Everybody, they wear some. You see, you see. Sammy just two shade. I say Googles. Say. You are wearing Googles, okay? <laughs> <laughs> but 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 it's good to have you guys in the studio, and uh, we've been looking forward to doing this together. But how have you been so far? 2018, how's it been like for you? Let me start with you, Derby. How's it been like the year so far? 
<coughs> oh, um, it hasn't been bad. It's been vimful. I, mm. you know, I recently released a song, Pure Water, featuring Efia. Pure Water, yes. yes. So we'll then, talk about that one. Okay, and then featuring <laughs> Efia was quite a big deal for me. Mm. And um, I released a video as well, which I've only seen positive comments about. Awesome. So, so there's hope. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Medical, how's the year been so far? Um, aside driving the, the Mercedes Benz, you know. <laughs> Charlie, it's been great. You know, dropping songs back to back, mm. uh, dropping a couple of danceable songs and hip hop as well. I recently dropped How Much Myself featuring Attitude and mm. Kasiata. I dropped ESU featuring Phil Black. Yeah. I'll be dropping, um, I'll be releasing an EP before the year ends. Okay. I'll be going on, on an Europe tour next week when I'm back. Yes, I saw, I saw the flyers yeah. on social media. Mm -hmm. So when I'm back, I'll give the dates and then, yeah, we'll go give to them. Nice, nice, nice. So in all, I mean, you'd summarize your, your year so far as what? Epic? So far, it's, it's been great. I've been going to places, meeting new people, connecting my music. Mm. And same people around the world, across the world. It's nice. It's awesome. Okay. Now, now Sister Derby, um, I mean, you've dropped Pure Water and all that. Yes. Um, I was also looking at, you know, dropping an EP later on or something. Oh, yes. Maybe an EP. I actually said that earlier this year, but um, mm. yes, so I am going to be doing that. But I have a show. Okay. A live band show. It's for free on the 23rd of August at Carbon. And wow. I've put um, three new artists, three upcoming artists um, on the bill as well they'll be opening for me okay um a girl called foo a girl called sophie and a guy called quicks oh nice yeah, so them in total will do like six songs and i'll do seven of my songs with a live band wow yeah so um 23rd august thursday night is free for anyone who wants to come at okay we definitely will be looking forward to that but but let me come to you medical um for the sake of our listeners who who probably haven't really heard of you know uh the story behind you before H how did you even come to the name medical in the first place what's your real name um my real name is samuel edu friend pong okay That's my real name the medical so was my name's sick yeah, yeah, Sammy, <laughs> Sammy Ways. That's yeah. Sammy. <laughs> that's Sammy. <laughs> yeah, so that's, that's my real name, Sammy Ways, different pong. And okay. the medical, it'd be summer school for that way, give me the time of day, THS. What you do, I will give you that name. <laughs> this story. And I guess some, some rap beats, some, it, it was one way rap. I was rapping, trying to prove I was a sick rapper, you know, them, okay. them kind of bars. And then it was one way, so they were teasing me. Uh, every day I've got this medical bus and then they got stuck. I see. So they started teasing me actually. We are just acceptable. Just that my spelling is -E -D -I -K -E -L instead of a C. Okay, yeah. I see. Mm -hmm. Awesome story behind your name. And um, did you always want to, you know, do music from a very young age? Yeah, yeah, man. Always. Always, Charlie. Then I won't, I won't, I won't talk my story. I wanted to say how I live. I wanted to speak, like, concerning where I came from, mm. the kind of lifestyle, how we hustle, how we try to make a living off anything. And then, um, yeah, so that'd be, be the hustle. That's what led me into the studio. It actually connected me to meeting people like Chris Wado, Visa K there and all. Mm. And then, yeah, we did great stuff. And then finally, I've got listeners who like my stuff. So it's awesome. The first time I saw you perform, um, I mean, the students were just going crazy. And I was like, who is this guy? <laughs> you know, um, did somebody literally hold your hand and, and, you know, introduce you to the industry or it was more of a struggle for you? Um it, um, it it was, you know, everything, there is a struggle, like, in anything you do, even before you go chop precedents, if you go struggle a lot before, you get me, it's a very nice calm position, mm. it's not about your books or your money or your school alone, you get me, so, there was a struggle here and there, going to the studios, not having peace to pick um church or something, mm. like the fans were in there, but I got someone who actually changed my life, that's Chris Wado, he actually brought me into the limelight, he actually told people that, yo, this is the guy you should listen to. Forget about me. Listen to this guy. So he's the plug. Mm. Get me like yeah. So he be anyway, he introduced me to the world. And then I always say this he's he's like a god in my life. You get me? Yeah. Nice. So shouts to Chris Waddle though. Nice. Shouts to Chris Waddle indeed. And Sister Derby. Yep. Um well, I do know that music runs in your family. Um, mm. I think I think we all know your brother is yes. is, a, is a genius when it comes Not to everyone music. Everyone knows who. People still uh, ask me that. Is he your real real brother? <laughs> is he really your brother? One of the Kubolo <laughs> is 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 your brother. But what's what's your your full name actually? Your real name? Okay, so my full name is Deborah Vanessa Owusu-Bonsu. Vanessa Owusu is the middle Bonsu. name. Yes. I yes. see. <laughs> You're interested I, in the Owusu-Bonsu. I, I right? didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> and um. 
I got the name Vanessa because I was born in 84 and in that year Vanessa Williams was made Miss America. She was the first, I don't know if she was the first, but I think she was the first black person okay. to be made Miss America. So my mom named me Vanessa after her. But Deborah is my first name. And Owusu Bon. So my family name is actually Owusu. But mm. my dad got Bonsu from his uncle because he was his favorite nephew. You know how we the Ashantis do. I don't know. Are you Ashanti or you're Fancy? No, I'm Fancy. Okay, Forsen. Yes. Forsen yeah. to be foreign. Fancy. <laughs> <laughs> that's now, my full name okay now now what has it that uh, your father is actually a man of god is, is that true um he preaches he's a pastor yeah a pastor not spaghetti pasta <laughs> <laughs> which one is spaghetti is, pasta you know pasta means oh okay okay, no, okay. ignore me ignore me when okay all right cool things. cool cool yes he is he's, oh, he's a, a man of god yes okay and um how was we it we are all men of god do or and eh? now where are we from? <laughs> if we are not all men of God, where are we from? <laughs> okay, uh, I think it's more of a pastor or a reverend, yes, you know, yes, yeah, for yes. want of better words. Mm -hmm, and um, the, how was growing up with, with, with your dad like? Okay, so um, my mom and us, like I have two older brothers, okay, mm. for my mom and dad. We left my dad when I was three. So I haven't lived with my dad wow. really before. And then growing up with him, so basically his obligation was paying school fees and then visiting us. And it was cool with for me because I was used to growing up with just my mom. Mm. So I was used to that. However, every Sunday, he would come and take us to the Chinese restaurants or take us I somewhere see. nice. He would take us to, remember, Nuga Hill Hotel in the evening for like a treat. But that would be like once in a while or once okay. every week. So that's the relationship with him. It's just a cool relationship. It's and just what, what does he make of your, your kind of music? Um, okay, so the first time he heard, well, my first song, Uncle Obama, he wasn't really happy about it. But then I think when he saw the consistency, mm. see, when you are consistent and people realize that that's your style, maybe your style is satirical, you know, it's comedy, it's for fun. Um, I mean, he doesn't complain about it now. Or even if he complains, you know me, I always have an answer <laughs> yeah. to something. So he just <laughs> ends up laughing. He just ends up laughing. He wasn't happy at the beginning, but... Um, I think he has realized that there's not much he can do. And what about your brother? Mm -hmm. Is he happy with the kind of music he makes? He makes or me? Your brother. Oh, whether my dad is happy. Yeah. Um, the same. Okay, so my dad, I know my dad to be a very open-minded person. But you see now, because of the church and the preaching and all that, I feel like there are people around him who give him pressure, who call and say, hey, have you seen what your son is doing? Have you? Mm. Because growing up, my dad was very open-minded. He used to chill. He didn't really used to go to church. Like, we had to beg him to come and take us to church on Sunday because wow. attending a Catholic school, you have to go to church so that you can get your first communion and those kind of things, right? Like, okay. You know? um, so he calls. He's worried. He, he called me the other day to talk about One Loves My T.O.T.O. T. O. song. That, hey, <laughs> what's my brother doing? What's going on? And I told him that, oh. That song is another matter for another day. Yeah, yeah. We call I, we call him Tata. It's daddy in Romanian because we okay. speak Romanian with him. Okay. I was like, oh, it's a, if you look at the video, it's quite positive. Girls are not being objectified. They are, you know, they are fully dressed. They have their natural hair. And then here, do you get what I'm saying? The roles mm. have been changed. So it's actually a positive look. And he was like, yeah, but what about the thing he's singing about? I'm like, oh, everybody does that in life and enjoys. Or then I realized, <laughs> oh my God, I'm talking to my father. <laughs> and then he started laughing and that was it. But you could tell that he is worried, and I feel it's okay. because of the calls and texts. I gets. see. Mm -hmm. All right, now let, let's talk about uh, medical and Sister Derby. Um, you, you, you guys are literally our power couple in, in the industry. Um, and what, what has kept you guys together all this while? I, I, I think I'll start with medical. Please start with medical. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's because it's, it's we, are, we are very natural. We don't hide stuff from each other. We, mm. You know, She'd be like a friend, not only like a girlfriend. You get me? Like we talk about everything. We are positive. We are we are both funny, so we get along. Yes. Yeah, so Who I is? Think. I'm funnier than you. Or uh, okay, when you do that, your sexy dance is funny. <laughs> 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 He's we like, are, why is she saying it here? We are we are we are all funny. Like you get me, and we are all entertainers, so we know how to make each other happy. So I think I guess that's the reason why we're still coming. I see. W what would you say, Debbie? Um, I would say um, medical has a very good sense of humor. Mm -hmm. Yes, so that's that's you know that's really good. He's very open-minded. He has a very good sense of humor, and um, he knows what he wants. Yeah, and he knows what we have. So okay, what, what we have. Yes. <laughs> How many years now? Oh, it's just two. 
Oh. Yeah, we need like two years. Two we years. Banging and banging for two years. This which one is a banging? <laughs> 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 <At least. laughs> yeah, a, a, and and, and it's, it's growing strong. Yeah, of course. Mm. Yeah, come, we the future is exciting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I see. Interesting. Mm-hmm. All right, if you have any questions for Medical Assistant Derby, you can actually send it via WhatsApp 0244340437. That's 0244340437. Well, Noella is here as usual with her announcements. Good morning, Noella. Good morning, Sammy. And how are you doing today? Not too good. Oh. Why? You want the banco capsules? Yeah. Okay. I missed it yesterday. Don't worry. Today I have MPC <laughs> drip. That's, <laughs> <laughs> That's all the announcements. Right. May I have your attention for the following announcements? Joy News presents the Joy News Western World Properties Habitat Fair 2018 in collaboration with MNC Properties. This fair is bringing together all financing companies, construction companies, real estate developers, home furnishing, and many more. Join them at the West Hills Mall from Saturday 18th to Sunday 19th August 2018, also at 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily. The Join News Western Broad Properties Habitat Fair 2018 is brought to you by Western Broad Properties. Live your true comfort. MNC Properties, a choice of class. Zenith City, the new airport city. Elegant homes and general construction, where you live your dream. Castle Steel Structures Limited, dream it, rebuild it. Fortune City Estate, a house, our fortune. Jail Properties, the city's favorite developer. The Greens, redefining living. And DBS Roofing, Roofing Papa Parfier. To sponsor or exhibit your products and services during the fair, contact 0243 859 367 or 0540 123 799. The numbers again 0243 859 367 or 0540 123 799. Join News Habitat Fair 2018. Affordable housing for all. The Skills Development Fund and Vital Micro, Small and Medium Enterprises across the country to apply for grant support to improve your capacity of your workforce uh, for enhanced productivity and competitiveness. Public and private training institutions are also invited to apply for support to develop innovative training content for the private sector. The application window is open till 31st August 2018. Enterprises in agribusiness and renewable energy sectors and those owned or managed by women especially are encouraged to apply. Visit www.sdfghana.org to apply. <laughs> Skills Development Fund, Skill in Ghana for Sustainable Development. Safe Doctor is an all new and exciting telemedicine app that allows doctors to consult with patients virtually anywhere in Ghana. Within the Safe Doctor app, the doctor can make full consultations, request labs through partnered laboratories, and also send prescriptions through partnered pharmacies. All these is done within all these are done within the Safe Doctor app. As the expanding Safe Doctor is requesting the services of qualified medical doctors to join their platform. You have an option to either do full-time or part-time employment. All that you need is an internet-connected computer. Interested pharmacies may, and labs may also apply. To be a part of this novel enterprises, call WhatsApp 0558 334704 for more details and registration. Safe Doctor is available as a free download on the Google Play Store. Safe Doctor, the future of better medical care. Attention all SHRM members and human resource professionals. Seek the HR certifications that are recognized globally as a standard for HR practice and contribute more to your organization's bottom line. The SHRM CP and SHRM CSP credentials are the most sought after competency-based certifications for HR professionals in Ghana and around the world. Join the next batch of HR professionals from blue chip organizations to study, share experiences and prepare for this enviable certification at CITAM the SHRM Education Partner in Ghana. Date is on Saturday, August 25th. Time is 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. And the venue is at the Sitam Learning Place, Circle Opposite Busy Internet. Call Kojo directly on 0204-224-826 to book your seat. Sitam, driving peak performance.
performance. End of announcements. All right, many thanks, Noel. I'll see you in the next hour. It's the Cosmopolitan Mix right here on Joy 99.7 FM, hanging out with uh, Medical and Sister Derby. And it's a great time to make sure that uh, you do your business with MT and Momo. It's the easiest and fastest way to do your business, uh, you know, and of course, your financial transactions. You can use MT and Momo to send money, receive money, pay your bills, pay school fees, salaries, allowances, and pay for your goods and services at any merchant point as well. There are three golden rules when you're using MTN Momo and you need to abide by these three. Rule number one, keep your MTN Momo pin safe. It is your secret. Uh, number two, don't give out your MTN Momo transaction details. And number three, perform all your MTN Momo transactions by yourself. Keep your account safe and secure and continue to enjoy a fast and convenient MTN Momo experience. Simply dial star 7170. That's star 170 hush and just Momo 8 everywhere you go. And if you have a registered mobile line, well, it's time to join Echo Bank's Thanks in a Million promo and be rewarded for doing transactions this week. All you need to do is download the Echo Bank mobile app from the Play Store, the App Store, and simply dial star 770 hush and activate your Express account. Then you can move on to start transacting. You can buy airtime, send mobile money, pay a bill, do a cardless withdrawal, send money to another bank, or simply send money across Africa on the Echo Bank mobile app this week. Now, what's going to happen is the top five transacting customers per each service will be handsomely rewarded every week till the end of the month. Echo Bank, the Pan-African Bank. The Cosmopolitan Mix right here on Joy 99.7. Any questions you have for Sister Derby and Medical, send it through 0244-340-437. Here's the new one, Medical, Kwesiatha, and, uh, of course, Attitude. It's called How Much. Six foot soldier, yeah. I did that mafia, bad boy composer. Yeah, me the member of Kushia, some man from Madavia. Take your take away from the boys, some me a number. We stand in so back at the beer, them a CC. Got like 3,000 checks buzzing in my DM. What a career, squawking punk. Put me on the microphone when I like the song, cause I like this song. I say you better when they watch the phone. If you know your money, you're right this wrong. Okay. I put my tongue on your girl in town. I make a study, call me Brad from Brown. Make a study, do the yoga when I like this song. Whoa. Jesus Christ, I think I'm nice. Yeah. Joy, 99.7 FM. Let's do the meat in my spam. I still my blood, they maximize. Whoa. I feel where you're basic a dime. Me go crack ass or China. She really never sees that my voice can't tell. Dino, I need your back. Money gang, money gang, money gang, money gang, money gang, money gang, money gang. See my hands. And that's uh, medical Kwesiatha. And uh, who, who's the third person? Attitude. Attitude. Yeah. Okay. And uh, uh, this is called How Much. Definitely, you have a thing for hip-hop music. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. When did you realize that hip-hop was your thing as a rapper? Um, do you mean when I started doing music? I said, when did you realize that hip-hop is like like really something that you, you crave for? Oh, when I was young, when I was like 11, that's when I started doing music. I went to the uh, studio for the first time mm. at 11, and I started doing hip-hop. Okay. hip-hop was the, the best way to express yourself lyrically. You get me? Like, that way you talk about where you're from and those things. Mm. So that's why I chose hip-hop. Who, who, who would you say are your influences when it comes to hip-hop music? Um, Skepta, Lil Wayne. Okay. Sarkodier. Lil Wayne, that's in the American one, not the Ghanaian. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's trying to do the hip hop? <laughs> hey, of course. I see. So, Lil yeah. Wayne. Yeah, Lil Wayne, Skepta, mm. Sakode, Wado, Payday, Yapuno, mm. you get me like Drake, all of them. Nice, them. nice, mm. nice, nice. Sister Derby, yes. how would you describe your kind of music? Um, Afro pop. Afro pop. Yes, please. Okay, because on the Uncle Obama track, you said this is the banana zone too. Banana zone too. <laughs> because um, I think on iTunes and stuff, <laughs> iTunes. Well, that was the Azonto period, and I came okay. with the banana dance, so we just did okay. the banana zone too. I feel like at that time you I should was have made really it Banazonto. Banazonto. Yeah. Hey, lyricist. Hey, no, 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 no. I see. Mami. Medico. <laughs> Um, what, what would you say has been your highest point so far as a, as a, as a, as a rapper or a, a musician? Um, I don't understand the English very well. 
can you break it down for me? What would you say has been your biggest achievement so far as an artist? Um, so far, the highest achievement ever, like in my career, is being able to mm. have a lot of fans. Because when I go out, when I'm on stage performing, I see a lot of people are showing me love. Because sometimes on social media, you see mm -hmm. a lot of people saying negative stuff yeah. like about you, trying to throw shots at you to make to belittle you. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So when I'm on stage and I see that crowd, I'm like, God, all these people love me. They can sing my lyrics word to word. Even songs I don't really, you know, sometimes I forget to perform mm. or don't bring out videos or don't really talk about them. They sing word to word and then it's love. So that's, that's, mm. and that's all I wanted. I wanted people to love my music, okay. to listen to my story. So, and then that's love. That's lovely. Okay. Now, in 2017, Ghana Music Awards, you had a total of seven nominations. Mm -hmm. And uh, definitely, you were all swagged up to win that night. And mm -hmm. I, for one, was even surprised you didn't win anything. Yeah. Uh, how did that make you feel? And how did you deal with that entire process? Um, I was disappointed I didn't win anything. But apart from that, life still goes on because I feel like, you know, it'd be them things. So it'd just be normal because... I have the love already, I have people who love my music, plus can determine how good I am. So, yeah, I just go over it and then moved on. Mm. Uh, Sister Derby, yes. I mean, you were by his side during that time, <laughs> I do remember. Yeah. Um, uh, how did I'll, you feel for, for, for your man as well? Well, I was actually in Belgium at the time and I, I shortened my trip because I had a show, a beauty pageant, I was hosting it and I, I didn't stay to enjoy Belgium. I you know, I booked my flight earlier so I could attend the show just for him because I was there because he was nominated. I wasn't nominated. Or were we nominated for Too Risky? I think, yeah. I don't even I know. So. But, like, I just came there to support Yeah, I, him I think so. I think, was yeah, Too Risky was, was nominated. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I was... I was shocked when I shouldn't have been shocked. Mm. Kind of. But I just felt that it just showed that there were greater things, you know, there for him. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. um... Yeah. I was yeah, disappointed. Yeah. Social media disappointed. and, you know, trolling. Yeah, you know, because... How did you deal with it? Ah, uh, normal. <laughs> you know, we've been through a lot of broken hearts, so you know, the social media <laughs> will break our hearts. Life, you know, it should be processed. Yeah, and you know, with so. the trolling, especially when they were trolling medical at that time, it w I noticed that it was his own fans that it was also hurting them, and they didn't want their friends to tease them. Did you get me? Yeah. So you joined those teasing. So okay. they were actually also hurt. A lot of people were shocked and disappointed. You mm. can, even people outside Ghana, everyone expected. Like, it was normal. It was... I mean, he had seven. How come not even one? It was a crime not to win. Yes. On so that the night. trolling deer, I, I, I mean, medical handled it, re handled it really well. Yeah. And then... I, mm. Yeah, I didn't take it to, you know, I knew that it was people who were also supportive of him, but were yeah. disappointed as well. Mm. Yeah. Okay. We have lots of questions coming in via WhatsApp, 0244340437. I get to them pretty shortly. But let's get to it. First of all, the two of you, how did you meet? Oh, Charlie, you've been dating for two years. I mean, you meet me, uh, you never ask me this question, but I'm, I'm asking oh, on yes. behalf of my listeners. His listeners. <laughs> How did you guys meet? Do you want meet? me to answer for you? Because no, I've been he's asking, asking me. No, he's oh, asking good, me. good. I hope you answer the WhatsApp ones too, okay? <laughs> 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 um, we, actually, uh, we actually met on Twitter. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, I see. Yeah, we met on Twitter, so... We, As in you saw her handle and you hit her up or you saw her Yeah, I wanted to do or... a song with her. So. Ah. No, 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 no. He saw me clap back in at someone and he retweet, retweeted and said... He retweeted. Hey, clap retweeted. So. <laughs> he retweeted <laughs> and said... Headline that. <laughs> He hey. and said, retweeted. Retweeted. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get you guys that. Like that. Oh, we, we like it. He hey. said, hey, you fool. Uh, <laughs> right? Do you remember when you said I fool? That's, yeah, and so I was like, who is this person? This person is like sounds like my people. He okay. said, hey, you fool. Uh, so I went to check and I realized he was an artist. And then what happened from there? Uh, <laughs> so yeah, we started talking. He started talking. He slid in into DM. my DM. Say that ah, part. Say I that see. part. I see. Interesting. For work. For work stuff. Yeah, wait, I wait. see. Oh, okay. And uh, after you retweeted, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Have I said to okay. <laughs> so, so, so when, 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 when did it get to that point where you guys felt there was a connection and all that? What, what was the question again? Oh, Charlie. Who is the question for? I was reading something on this book. It is for him. Got so, when did you realize, say, Charlie, this is the one you want to be with? Um. So we met at um. So, from a uh, radio station like that. <laughs> and then, yeah, so when we met at Tukanama there, we started talking and then, okay. yeah, and then we started vibing that too. 
I see. Yeah. I see. What is it that you like about medical so much that makes him so different from sexy other body. <laughs> sexy body. Sexy body. Like my six packs. <laughs> Oh, he doesn't have six packs. Oh, I have six packs. Oh, he, he has, has, he has. It's oh. just he has two. He has two, please, it's please, please, I beg. <laughs> Why are you hitting on a brother? Uh, he's somewhere <laughs> like me. It's a somewhat thing. I'm telling you, he has two. Why are you hitting on a brother? Uh, what do I like about him? He's very kind and um, he's very mature in the relationship. Okay. When he wants to be. <laughs> when he wants to be. <laughs> no, no, most of the time, most of the time. Okay. Yeah, yeah, he's very now, kind. Now, now um, we've mm-hmm. actually heard, I don't know if, if that's accurate, but you're older than him. Yes. And uh, does age really matter in a relationship? I mean, to you? I mean, it mattered to me at the beginning when, when like, we were talking. Well, we started talking. I was worried about it, but um, he assured me that he wasn't worried about it. So he didn't understand why I was worried about it. Okay. And um, so far, like, in the relationship, I don't really think of that. Mm. Yeah, I don't. Okay. Yeah. So you guys are going the long haul. Please, the English. <laughs> you guys are... Yeah, you're English. You're English. Ah, you're English. English. Oh, oh, you're too advanced. Oh, then cut you. Some of it's bro. Oh, yeah, yeah. And yeah, You mean the long way, like looking... Yes, I take it all term. the way, you know, marriage, long you know, term. to death, do us part. We are taking it long term. Long term. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, you did tweet not too long ago mm-hmm. that you just might not get married. Medical. I might, I might not get. Oh, I was just, I was just kidding. It was oh. one of them things. Is, oh. is it, is it because I, I farted on you in the bedroom? Oh no, no, it's not that. You did what? <laughs> farted. Ew. Really? I'm joking. <laughs> no, no, I was just, I was just kidding. It was just one of them things. I see. Yeah, it was just one of them things. Are you sure? Yeah, because you know, sometimes I think that if you are with a girl and then, and then you lo- love each other and then you are together, then. Yeah, you know, you no need to, you know, go to some extra mile again, and then, you know, because people they get married and get divorced. Sometimes I think I, I think out loud, so I, I say some stuff, mm. but you know, it's not that deep. You know? Okay, so mm-hmm. it was one of those showbiz yeah. moves. You get me? Yeah. It wasn't a showbiz move because you would have dropped a hot, a hot song right after that. No, it wasn't. It wasn't for hype or publicity or anything. No, just... Were you getting calls from people like, "What's going oh, on? Are you like, guys okay?" Just like three texts: one from my manager, and then like two friends. I see. Yes. Oh, yeah. cool. w- what is it that makes their no, no? So they asked special? me why is he tweeting that, and I said, "Oh, his name is he's in his menses. Just ignore." <laughs> <laughs> it's in his menses. Just ignore. Medical. <laughs> I'm sure you've dated other women. What what makes Derby so special? Oh, she's she's cool. She's funny. She's clever. She's smart. Yeah, and then she understands me. So yeah, mm. that's what makes her special. What influence does she have over you? She actually teaches me a lot. She she, she shows me a lot of moves. Corrects me when I'm going wrong and all. So yeah. Does she like cooking? Does she like cocaine? No, she's no, not cooking. No like cooking. Hey, hey cooking. Oh. Hey. No, she doesn't like cooking. <laughs> Does not like cooking? No. So you know I don't lie. I don't know how to lie. I'm sorry. But when we're at East Legon Hills, wasn't no, no, I cooking? No, no, but you don't cook. It's you been don't long. Like it's okay. been like so many months you now. Don't say to. They'll start bringing food to your house with a uh, lace cloth <laughs> in baskets covering the food, please. <laughs> you don't like cooking? No. Wow. Why? Any particular like reason? I don't like cooking. You don't like eating? Cooking is not a passion or a hobby. If I have to cook for somebody, I'll do it, but I just don't like cooking in general. Okay. Yes. And you're cool with that, medical? Oh, of course. I'll be cool. So you guys are always eating out? You must no, no, no. Or we're you not, have a we're chef? We're always eating out. Um, medical knows how to cook. I know and how to his cook. His friends cool. know how to cook. And if you do jollof and things, so. Yeah. If you then jollof, we chop finish. You do feel dizzy or. Drowsy. Totally. Yeah. Cause right now the jello of there, be like suck or they take the the, the crown. Oh. No, no, no. It, I, they, I go to my house. Maybe let him day. take jello crown. You have FIFA crown. Eh? Oh, you have FIFA. Crown. oh, yeah. Talking about FIFA, mm-hmm. I, I heard you disciplined Sack Nation. <laughs> oh, the whole success game. music. <laughs> oh, come on. Come you on. went in there and skia. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but is. you don't meet me yet, so <laughs> make you hey. know, make no, you know, no, celebrate no. too much. No, no, no. So, I mean, you know, I don't want, I don't want. Play FIFA with you then because this of that, weekend you stop we, they play my songs. Oh no 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 no! Yeah, no. Yeah. So if I score you two, then what? If oh no, you know if you score me. Sammy, you cannot score. Eh. No 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 no. Mm. 
Okay. Okay. So it be real. It be real. We will bet. Okay. If cool. I score you, you know what we go do. If you I no no no, you know what we go do. Game. No 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 no. Oh. I go put maybe like ten thousand Ghana dollars. No, it not be money. No, listen. No 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 no. no it no. should be money. No no no. No, it should be money. If no. I score you, you host my show for a week. Hey Charlie. Hey, too busy to do that. Hey, that one. That one. Hey, you change your name to Sammy Forsey. <laughs> if I score you, I will record a song. <laughs> okay. I'll rap. Okay, then you two yes. will go perform my shoes. <laughs> I go perform, but <laughs> you go, go walk around now. <laughs> Before I jump on stage you, and jump into the crowd. <laughs> okay, sir, for now. All right, so many questions coming in. I get to them pretty shortly, but let me just remind you about the Emmy Africa Awards. The stage has been set for West Africa's most prestigious awards. Uh, celebrates distinguished men. Of course, bigger, better, and more exciting. The third annual Emmy Africa Awards comes up on the 18th of August at the Kempiski Hotel right here in Accra as we celebrate and honor the men of the year. You want to make sure that you vote for your favorite nominees in various categories. You want to do that uh, with your phone. Simply dial star 713, star 714, hush, and uh, just vote. Oh, I mean, just quickly download the Speak Up mobile app from the App Store and vote as well. Who makes it this year? Log on to www.emiafrica.com or simply follow at Emmy Africa on all social media platforms for more information as well. A big thank you to our gold sponsors, Land Rover, DVO, as well as Dominion Petroleum, Empire Domus, Axis Shipping, as well as Johnny Walker. A big thank you to our supporting sponsors, Alliance Ghana, as well as NASCO Electronics, Medimosis, Post Center, as well as Special Ice Water, Carabao Energy Drink, Clifton Homes, Arocha Ghana, EY um, Ghana, as well as UNAIDS, Media Partners, Joy Prime, Joy News, Joy FM, Joy Business, uh, Graphic News App, as well as BFT and Daily Guide. For reservations or more inquiries, simply call 020 201 8870. That's 020 201 8870. Emmy Africa Awards, inspiring greatness. Now, if you're a family person and you have that amazing baby at home as well, well, you want to take part, I mean, take part of uh, this incredible offer. I mean, Cousins Baby Photo Competition is now in town and Cousins Baby Moments is a 13-week of family fun bonding with the baby right in the center as well. All you need to do is to simply buy a Cousins Baby gift pack or any three Cousins Baby products, all right? And you want to take a picture, I mean, a cute, awesome picture with your baby together with the Cousins products upload it to www.cousinsbaby.com that's cousinsbaby.com and join us this thursday to sunday for a free uh, photo shoot with your baby at the west hills mall the cousins baby ghana facebook page you can log on there and get more details t's and c's apply cousins baby growing together naturally well i get to your questions pretty shortly we get to talk about sister david's new song as well but in the meantime though Here's one of my favorite songs from Sister Derby. It's called Bola. First thing you did, holla, holla, holla. Spending all your dollar, dollar, dollar. Now where you get lola, lola, lola. You just see me like some bola, bola, bola. First thing you did, holla, holla, holla. Spending all your dollar, dollar, dollar. Now where you get lola, lola, lola. You can see me like some bola, bola, bola. Adikai, 36 missed calls, the time you try. Trip me, make a fall, catch me, pass your eye. Showed me off at the mall, then up in the sky. Held make you stand tall. That way you promise, promise, say you go love me, love me till I be wobbly, wobbly way you pour bubbly, bubbly no be for ugly, ugly they fear my beauty, beauty they lie in body, my body, my body. Hala, 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 spending all your dollar, dollar, dollar. Now when you get lola, 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 you just see me like some bola. And that is Bola. I was I was hoping for a remix with Medical on this. Um, <laughs> but but how did you come by the name Bola? I mean, you always have funny, unique <laughs> names for your songs. Okay, so Bola is a breakup song where um, the girl is being dumped by the guy. And you know how in Ghana... Our and in the video, dumped, you, you were in a dustbin. I was in a dustbin because he dumped me in the refuse dump. And um, 
um, instead of calling it refu- downpour, you know, that kind of thing, I decided to go with a name that is... Um, local. Local, as medical would say. Local, local. Local. So basically, I decided to use Ghana Pigeon, Bola. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. I see. Uh-huh. I see. Yeah. I, I was even thinking maybe you're going to be a sanitation ambassador or something. I am actually an environmentalist, self-appointed. Oh, okay. So in the Bola video, I try to showcase... Um, People cleaning up after the sel- themselves as not something bad or something to be ashamed of. Mm. So I portrayed the bin as a very neat bin. You can even keep your dustbin neat. Oh. You need to wash your dustbin and dry it in the sun. And I then see. If there's the scene where I'm sweeping the leaves. So I'm sweeping something that I'm going to throw away, but mm. the whole place is still neat. So it's just trying to portray, you know, cleanliness and positivity, even with Bola. Okay, I see. Interesting. Yes. Uh, we'll get to the big one, which is uh, pure water as well. Okay. Yes, um, I saw some shots from the video shoots, and we'll get talking. How romantic is medical? Oh, hmm. me. We will find out right after <laughs> the news. Well, this very young, oh, don't friends. worry. You are a role model. You have to teach them <laughs> to be romantic because it's a good thing. Yeah, the, the, the women need it. <laughs> well, let's get into the news at 11 o'clock and Araba Kumsin is here. Good morning. Hi, Sami. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Let's okay, have the news. In the headlines, Energy Think Tank, Africa Center for Energy Policy, proposes direct discussions with Ameri to bring down tariffs as sector minister is sacked for allegedly misleading the president and seven officials of a Greek ministry in Bonahafu region under investigation for allegedly stealing fertilizers worth 600,000 CDs. Details now. The Africa Center for Energy Policy says the government must now hold talks with the providers of the Ameri power plant to bring down tariffs. Energy Minister Boache Jaku has been sacked after almost reaching a deal with a third party to handle the plant, but at a higher cost to the taxpayer. Policy analyst at ASEP Ben Boache says direct talks with Ameri is a better option. The persons or the company we have engage or a contract with is the Ameri itself and we have to engage them and probably appeal to them and say hey this is if we see the contract give the public some money because ultimately if the public is not able to pay through the tariff you're not also going to get your money okay and you know cash calls delayed and everything affects them also so that you can come to that understanding and agree that some savings ought to be passed to uh, uh, the consumer and I think that is the only way you can make it a third way Going around it, negotiating with the parties, I don't think that is the right thing to do. Engage the people we have a contract with and appeal to them that we cannot pay this much and that they have to bring down the time. You had policy analyst at ASEP, Ben Boache. In a separate development, the East Legon District Police has launched investigations into alleged threats on the life of public relations officer for the Energy Ministry, Nana Damwa. Joint news sources say Mr. Damwa filed an official complaint with the police after receiving threats of death following comments he made relating to the controversial Ameri deal. Seven officials of the Greek Ministry are currently being investigated for allegedly stealing fertilizers worth about 600,000 CDs. The fertilizers were meant for the planting for food and jobs program, but were allegedly kept in a warehouse. They went missing nine months into the start of the program in October last year. At a news conference in Sunyang, Punoahafu Regional Minister Kweku Asumatreme said his outfit will act on the police report once they conclude investigations. We could see on the hindsight that the quantity missing worth about 600,000 Ghana cities. In the old cities, it will be about 6 billion. And that is what is under investigation now. There was arrest, but there has not been any interdiction. The investigation, if the police are able to complete it by the close of them, will tell us as to which step to take. He had Bonoahafu Regional Minister Kweku Asumatreme. President Ekufuado has called on African heads of state to denounce in the strongest terms all forms of human rights abuses. The president said this when he addressed participants at the Moot Court on human rights in Accra. We therefore have a sacred task to ensure that the fight for the protection and respect for human rights remains a constant one. We need to mount constant vigilance in protection of our individual and collective liberties, without which all our efforts will come to naught. No society can be truly free unless its citizens feel the need to embrace both liberty and duty. To this end, we must denounce 
and seek rapidly to bring to an end acts of piracy, civil wars, internal violent conflicts, human trafficking, acts of terrorism, forced displacement of large numbers of people, largely women and children, and endemic violations of human rights, which continue to blight the lives of millions of Africans and impose intolerable burdens on them. President Ekufuado on the international front, Ivory Coast jailed former First Lady Simone Bagbo has been granted amnesty by the president in what he says is a move to foster reconciliation. In 2015, Mrs. Bagbo was sentenced to 20 years for her role in the violence that followed the 2010 elections in which more than 3,000 people died. Her husband, Laurent Bagbo, is on trial at the International Criminal Court for Crimes Against Humanity. Mrs. Bagbo was among 800 people that President Alassane Ouattara pardoned. And those are your headlines. At 11, we're back at midday. You are tuning to your Super Hits Radio, Joy 99.7. Stay with us. How hot can a phone be? Swag up with the all-new Infinite Hot 6 Pro, equipped with a drawer camera to take for some amazing pictures, Infinity display, and a Snapdragon processor for a faster and smooth performance. This is one for the pop and funky. Enjoy a double amazing experience with the all-new Infinite Hot 6 Pro, now available in all mobile phone shops in Ghana. Infinite Hot 6 Pro, it's double amazing. Win 10,000 Ghana CDs on CousinsBaby.com.gh I am Dr. Keisha. Acacia's superior IT support enables making payment on claims twice as fast as the regular health insurance providers in the country so your workers get treatment quickly and can return to handling your business. Acacia Health Insurance. We place value on those you value. Concerned about your family's safety at your home or business? Worry no more. Get more. Call Trelidor 0561 24 24 24. For any window or door, get more. Call Trelidor 0561 24 24 24. For unique custom made solutions, get more. Call Trelidor 0561 24 24 24. Trelidor, Africa's strongest burglar proofing. Running a local company? Ready to grow faster, go further? Well, now you can with faster targeted solutions from EcoBank Commercial Banking. Our easy to use digital platforms and super responsive service can help you deliver smarter collection, payment, and trade solutions for your business right away. To get a powerful Pan African platform working for you starting today, contact a dedicated relationship manager with local corporate expertise at cmbghana at ecobank.com or use our easy self service solutions at ecobank.com. Echo Bank, the Pan African Bank. The stage is set for West Africa's most prestigious awards that celebrate great men. Bigger, better, and more exciting. The third annual Emmy Africa Awards comes off on the 18th of August, 2018, at the Kempinski Hotel, Gold Coast City, with thrilling performances from the legendary musician Daddy Luna and the Jormi hitmaker from Nigeria, Simi, and many other great acts. Visit emmyafrica.com or at Emmy Africa on all social media platforms for more information. Gold sponsor Land Rover, DVO, Dominion Petroleum, Empire Domos, Axis Shipping, and Johnny Walker. Supporters include Allianz Gun, NASCO Electronics, the Medi Moses Prostrate Center, Special Ice Water, Carabao Energy Drink, Clifton Homes, Empire Concrete, and Arrocha Gun, EY Ghana, and UNA. Media Partner, Joy Prime, Joy News, Joy FM, Graphic, BFT, and The Daily Guide. For reservations and inquiries, do call 020-201-8870. This week on the Joy Business Van, giving your vehicles a dazzling look. Two pharmacists behind Autodazzle, car cleaning products manufactured right here in Ghana. We've always had a passion for cars. I yeah. mean, to the point that in school, when you open our laptops, the first thing you see is a screensaver with some uh, Mercedes Benz or a BMW. And we can tell you what brand it is, what model it is, that kind of thing. So the first thing was to find out what's on the market. And then quickly we realized it's only fabric detergents that are used to wash cars. And we realized, no, that will straight away damage your paint. And that's not acceptable. Pampering your vehicles with Autodazzle. This week on the Joy Business Van. 
on TV, radio, online, and on ground. The Joy Business Van is powered by Joy Business and supported by EcoBank, the Pan African Bank. Win 10,000 Ghana CDs on cousinsbaby.com.gh. This was Kwame's life before Interplast in Green Irrigation System. <laughs> Sorry, what could come from? In the dry season, Kwame would use buckets to water his five-acre farm. By evening, he's so tired. So his wife said, Oh, Kwame, Emre Dania, Danny B, haven't you heard of In Green Drip Irrigation Pipe? In Green Drip Irrigation Pipe? Yes. Akosia told me they use it. See how green their fields are, even in the dry season. You just set it and then psh, 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 it waters the whole place. No waste. Save time and money. And we can farm all year round. Hey, Ajua, what can I move? It's a dry bucket, no? not just in green drip pipes. Time, mommy. Ah. Good farmers harvest all year with InGreen. Call us now on 0302-819-000. Another quality solution from Interplast. At Afrodan, we believe that many of the problems people have with their health is as a result of the way they sit. In other words, your chair can kill you. Here's Dr. Marcus Mann of the Chiropractic and Wellness Center. What you have to remember is that the spine is the lifeline to your body. And posture is the window to that spine. Now, posture is affected by your daily activities and habits like sitting. That's why at the Chiropractic and Wellness Centers, we recommend what I believe to be the best chairs available for preventing not only subluxations, but also other health problems that you may not be aware of, and that's Rabami and Mobilex chairs. Unfortunately, on a daily basis, I have to correct the effects of this poor sitting habit in our businessmen and businesswomen. Always remember, optimal spine equals optimum health. So, for the sake of your health, buy Robami or Mobilex chairs from Afrodan. We are on the first floor of the Swansea Shopping Arcade. Telephone 663-085. Accra Academy Upright, the school of no regret. The Accra Academy Old Boys Association, powered by the Blow Year Groups, proudly presents the Blow Be Homecoming 2018. Saturday, the 11th of August, at the school campus. Time, 9 a.m. Are you ready for some excitement? Come, let's live up the Blow experience. Watch out for the live band section going down. Bro call, tag of war, arm wrestling, Gary Sokin's competition, the bonfire and fireworks. Are you ready for some jamma? Saturday, the 11th of August, 9 a.m. Come join in on the fun. Let's reminisce on some old times. A cracker, our pride. A cracker, blow. The stage is set for West Africa's most prestigious awards that celebrate great men. Bigger, better, and more exciting. The third annual Emmy Africa Awards comes off on the 18th of August, 2018, at the Kempinski Hotel, Gold Coast City, with thrilling performances from the legendary musician Daddy Luna and the Jormi hitmaker from Nigeria, Simi, and many other great acts. Visit emmyafrica.com or at Emmy Africa on all social media platforms for more information. Gold Sponsor, Land Rover, DVO, Dominion Petroleum, Empire Domus, Axis Shipping, and Johnny Walker. Supporters include Allianz Gun, NASCO Electronics, the Medi Moses Prostrate Center, Special Ice Water, Carabao Energy Drink, Clifton Homes, Empire Concrete, and Arrocha Gun, EY Ghana, and UNA. Media Partners, Joy Prime, Joy New, Joy FM, Graphic, DFT, and The Daily Guide. For reservations and inquiries, do call 020 201 8870. This August, your preferred on-air business program, Masterclass, will discuss the use of social media and building a business. Our facilitator is Chris Wola Esipe, who is a lecturer, communications consultant, and social media strategist. For every business to survive in this time, it is critical that they understand these key areas. Social media as a tool for business communication, which I'll be looking at in greater detail. Then there is also the need for them to understand how to build an in-house social media strategy for the business, and then 
and finally they need to understand how to recover from social media failure. I mean, truth is this: the only companies that will not suffer any social media failure are the ones that are not on social media. But how can you afford not to be on social media in this time? Your competition is there. The people you are targeting to reach are there. So if you are not there, then you are nowhere really. Tune into the masterclass every Wednesday at 1:15 p.m. on Joy 99.7 FM. And don't forget to interact with us on Facebook at Joy Business or at Joy 99.7 FM. And if you tweet, the handle is at Joy Business or at Joy 99.7 FM. Ghana, it's time for God Almighty to inhabit the praises of his people. Adon Praise 2018 brings you a dynamic assembly of the finest praise and worship leaders. Let's join heart with one accord to glorify the Lord of hosts. The gateway of heaven will open as Diana Hamilton. Sax Bossa, Willie and Mike. Pastor Kwame Manukwe and Kweku Jesse usher us to the heavenly throne room. The dew of heaven will fall on the ministration of Elder Mreku and Ebenezer Benjamin. Eben, to shatter all yokes to declare victory. There is power, there is power in your name. The date is Friday, 31st August 2018, and the venue is Paris Dome, John Junction. Join the conversation. Hashtag Adon Praise 18. Adon Praise 2018 is brought to you by Vodafone. The future is exciting. Ready? And Yield Money Plus, Fasu Suto, Sponsors, DBS Roofing Sheets, Roof Papa Parafi, Belacqua, Proudly Ghanaian, Dr. Caesar Lina Energy Drink, Ada Bridge, Away, Amanak Real Estate. You dream it, we build it. Franco Traded Enterprise, Phone Papa. Papafi, Vitamilk, a meal on its own, classic no mosquito coil and spray, Wubede Fili, Escort Security Services, Think Safety, Choose Escort Security, Goldman Capital, Financial Support, Solid as Gold, Fresh Lady, Yopo Fresh, Araba Basin Pills, Maya Obasima, Media Partners, Precious TV, Footprint TV, Sweet Melodies FM, Sunny FM, Spring FM, and powered by the Multimedia Group Limited, Adum 106.3 FM, yeah, yeah, tough, Adum Praise 2018. Yeah, baby. Come, let's go. The station with the best, 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 best music. Best music. I love the music. Best music. Joy 99.7 FM. Keep this frequency clear. Sammy, Sammy Forsen is on. The Cosmopolitan Cosmopolitan I'm 
the Cosmopolitan Mix right here on Joy 99.7. That's music from Medico for you, bringing the time to 19 minutes past uh, 11 o'clock. And yes, uh, the Ghana Secondary Technical School GSTS is commemorating its Silver Jubilee celebration for the 93 all, I mean, all level year group, which coincides with the 108th uh, anniversary celebration of the school as well. And uh, in the view of this, they are selected to expand and refurbish the sick bay of the school as well. Now, there are a couple of activities lined up and uh, this project in actual fact has been approved by the GSTS Alumni Association um, and we, the 93 O-Level Year Group, have decided to execute the work. We intend to deliver this project by the next speech and prize given day in November. Now, some of the works to execute include the extension of the existing facility, possible addition of at least one or two consulting rooms for a nurse or a visiting doctor, as well as an isolation room, treatment room, general ward for the sick, dispensary, secure medical storage room, sloping sink to be located outside, as well as a reception, a toilet and bath, water supply and vehicular access as well. We therefore entreat all giants and the general public to assist in completing this project. You can send your contribution through the Giants 1993 account uh, with Unibank, a now consolidated bank. Uh, that's the Accra Central branch. The account number is 311-013-103-9213. That's 311-013-103-9213. Or simply send it via mobile money to the uh, phone number 020-202-9973. That's 020-202-9973. We are counting on your support. And well, uh, Wisconsin International University College, Ghana, has opened admissions for the 2018-2019 academic year. You want to enroll now for undergraduate courses in law, IT, nursing and midwifery, business studies, general um general business as well as uh, communication studies, economics and development, as well as environmental studies and many more. You can go in for postgraduate, there's MBA, there's MA Adult Education, there's MSc Environmental Sustainability and Management, as well as Strategic Management and Leadership. Wisconsin International University is fully accredited by the National Accreditation Board and is affiliated to top universities like University of Ghana, University of Cape Coast, KNUST, as well as UDS. We do offer internship opportunities for our students during and after the period of study as well if you want to go in for the day evening or weekend options we have them all available you can go in for a top up as well uh, for hnd and nac slash nap diploma holders as well pick up a form at our main campus north ligon abuba road or our city campus at st paul's lutheran school complex in kanda near gbc you have till the end of september 2018 to do that you can actually call or WhatsApp us on 020544-853-383 or 0560-011754. That's 0544-853-383 or 0560-011754. Wisconsin International University College, Ghana, leaders in international education. Cosmopolitan makes hanging out with... Uh, Sister Devi and medical as well. Now, let me get to you. Uh, loads of messages coming in. One here says, um, why is medical and showboy always at each other's necks? That's from Tudo in Jolu. I don't know. I think the last time I interviewed you as well, uh, a question came in like that. Yeah. Uh, who is showboy? Showboy, he's, he's my personal blogger. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, and fan. And, and fan, fan yeah. yeah. Okay, and and are, are you guys at each other's necks whatsoever? No, no, no. We are always, you know, on our, on knees or shoulders. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay one here says please tell derby and medical that ricky bone loves them and they should rep blue cheese party uh, i think uh we'll need a track again uh from them poof beyond control yeah we love him too okay yes. good morning mr yeah. forson please ask sister debbie medical how they see their relationship in five years to come tell sister debbie i love her shades that's nanakia from la paz five years to come thank you mm. five years to come we will we'll be in a very positive place still happy you know obviously still doing moves together making have other. you guys had the conversation of kids 
Always. Always. Yeah, yes. sometimes. You look like you 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 would love kids, Medico. Yeah, Charlie. Mm. Mm. How how many kids he, do you want to have? Children. Me, I would like have like two kids. Two. One boy, one girl. One boy, one girl. Yeah. Right. What about you, Debbie? Yes, yeah, same. One boy. One girl. That looks like him. <laughs> and one girl that looks like me. I don't want the girl to look like him. I want the girl to look like me. Okay. <laughs> and the boy to look like But, do you, but we can't tell the future. Do any of you have, have kids already? We, we don't have, have food. Like, do you have what? Do, you have do kids? we have kids already? Oh, no. No, I'm no. saying that we can't tell the future because we don't have the sticker. But this is what <laughs> I want. And this you is don't what have what? Hobinim sticker <laughs> to be able to tell the future. <laughs> but this is I, that's the same thing I want. Yeah, but what's what's the age difference, by the way? Eight. Eight. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so you are. Twenty-six. 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 Oh, yeah, Twenty-seven. Remember, today's have been when. And you are. I'm going on thirty-four. Okay. All right. Cool. Okay. Uh, one here says, um, please ask him if he has plans of raising up, uh, you know, up-and-coming rappers like Chris Waddle did for him. I'm sure he does. Yeah, yeah, I do. I, I put I put someone on the Hammer track that you asked me who he was. His name is Attitude. Okay. I'm trying to bring him up. Nice. Yeah, so nice. Yeah. Nice. Nice. One here says, um, medical sounds too serious. Why? I did Sammy Fossin beat him to FIFA? Anyway, more of him for him. That's Paul from Kaswa. Paul, I beat him already. Uh, <laughs> In your dream, Sammy Fossin. <laughs> oh, but you crack, you crack and you play FIFA. Oh, no, me. I don't play. So, games. so how's it like in the house when boys are playing FIFA? What are you normally doing? Okay, we don't live together. I mean, when you're around. When I'm around and they are playing, oh, I leave them to play. Oh, yeah. I don't enjoy it. I just leave just, them to play and I go and watch movies in the room or something, or go and play with the dogs. But oh, okay. I'm not interested in FIFA at all. Yeah, I saw a post of you. Wait, with, I'm only with interested if there's cha cha involved. And then, girl, let's have Oh, so you, you, you hold on to the money. <laughs> I'm the treasurer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the dogs. Medical's cute dogs. Oh, okay. How many dogs do you have? I have two. Two. Chucky and X. Shout out to Chucky and X. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I see. Yeah. Interesting. Can I give a quick shout out? Yeah, sure. sure shout sure. out to Elliot, to CD. Today is his birthday, and he's one of Medical's biggest fans from Tishi. Shout out to Elliot, to CD. He, Say no more. Yeah, his favorite song right now is How Much. How much? How much? How much? How much? Okay. <laughs> Let me get to some more messages. One here says, I'm Beatrice Angela. Uh, please, I want to ask Sister Derby if it's true she went to Christ the King International School. I also went there and I completed it in 2015. And I was made to know that she passed through the same school. And I was so proud and happy. I love your Sister Derby. Did you go to Christ the King International? Yes, I went to Christ the King International School. And I finished in like, I think, 99 to 2000. That's like centuries ago. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Really, but yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. one here says, This is your boy Ali D. Baron. Please tell medical to do music with AMG Baron. I want uh, I want that guy. AMG Baron One, that's his name. Okay. AMG Baron One. All yeah. right, Sister Debbie is very gorgeous. I just wanted her to know that and also to let medical know that the boys are wild, so he should treat her like a diamond. Okay. Uh, secondly, medical. Name uh, your top five hip hop artists, not rappers, but artists. I also saw the video of him uh, next to Fowls and Berry. Something good cooking. Okay. Good job, my brother. So your top five hip hop artists in no particular order. Skepta, Drake, uh, Payday, Quisiata, Attitude. Okay. Mm. No manifest, no. No. No patapa. <laughs> 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 okay. Do you ever get jealous, you know, when people come around Derby? Um, not really. Not really? No, not really, because I know that, like, she's calm. The, okay. the work we do, a lot of people love to come close to you, like all the time. They like to come and talk to you, take pictures, and also. Okay. I don't really. Yeah. Derby, it was rumored that. Wait, he doesn't um, get jealous because he knows I'm trustworthy. See, I've raised the shades for this <laughs> one because <laughs> he knows I'm good. <laughs> do you do you also get jealous whatsoever? I mean, um, the rumors about uh, is it uh, Fela McAfee and all that coming around him? Oh, it's normal for a girl to get jealous. Mm. Especially when there's so many rumors and people saying stuff. Yeah. Mm. So what do you do when you're jealous? Um, I talk to him. We we communicate. We okay. Talk. Yeah, yeah. 
Okay, I see. All right, some more questions coming in or messages coming in. One here says, uh, Sami F., I love medical uh, a lot from, uh, you know, from a great fan. Ask him what's the meaning of poof, poof, <laughs> swag. Well, um, what's the name again? Um, S- Sami. Uh, uh. No, he, okay, that's um, as a fresh, fresh Kodi <laughs> trap star from Mile 7. <laughs> MDK, forget everybody. Charlie, forget everybody, forget everybody. So poof be um poof be disappear. You get me? When the oh, magician okay. says poof, it then means it disappears. So it means pastors too can say poof, then you fall down. Yeah, and then to them <laughs> I won't be that. And also uh, vanish. <laughs> yeah, so it means if we come to obviously if we disappear, we then kind of vibe. So Okay, one here says life is all about the ups and downs. Keep motivating the youth. AMG beyond control. God bless. Uh one here says, secondly, there's a word on the streets of Sutium as to why I'm MDK know they give shout outs to people in the hood he grew up oh. at. Um, that's Auntie Aku. Please ask him why. Is that accurate? Uh, I never grew up in Auntie Aku. I'd stay, I moved there at a at certain point. I grew up in Sotio. Okay. I always say Sotio. Yeah. Okay. All right. One here says, Good morning, Bryce. I mean, I uh, love them both. Please ask uh, MDK when his joint EP with Papi is dropping. And the Money Gang track with Waddle. That's Swag. Um, <laughs> Fishbone. <laughs> Actually, that's Fishbone from Shouts Pram Pram. Shouts to Fishbone. Shouts to Fishbone inside Pram Pram. Lots of music. Lots of music that comes hey, in soon. Yeah, you have music. Uh-huh. Oh, that, that one is there. No, no, no. Google them. Google them. Google them. Oh, Google no, no. Maybe music. <laughs> but in Bass, if you watch. Okay, we'll record and we'll watch and later. Oh. <laughs> you buy, you buy <laughs> music. Hey, why is it? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, okay. I feel if you say what. Uh huh. Degba de. Oh, thank you. Oh, I remember Degba. I always forgot. Ask me. Why? Hey. Oh, wait. But wait, oh. No. This producer is out here. Ah. Okay. Hey, you walked all the way from here. Charlie, Degba was so unique. I couldn't even see us. Charlie, I can tell you instead of looking for, I said retweeted. But medical said musics. You can't say musics. No, no, it's correct. Ah. Ah. Twatted. Oh, no, twatted. Not twatted. Okay. Retweet- hey, what did I retweeted. Retweeted. <laughs> I said twatted, wow. not twatted. So wow. I retweeted your music. <laughs> 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 Too bad. I told you I'll get you back. <laughs> All right. So keep your questions coming in via WhatsApp 024 Noella is back with the announcements. Welcome back. Thank you. Please proceed. May I have your attention for the following announcements? Joy News presents the Joy News Western World Properties Habitat Fair 2018 in collaboration with MNC Properties. This fair is bringing together all financing companies, construction companies, real estate developers, home furnishing, and many more. Visit the Joy News Western World Properties Mini Habitat Fair 2018 clinics at the West Hills Mall from Saturday 18th to Sunday 19th August 2018 from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily. The Joy News Western World Properties Habitat Fair 2018 is brought to you by Western World Properties. Live your true comfort. MNC Properties, a choice of class. Zenith City, the new airport city. Elegant homes and general construction, where you live your dream. Castle Steel Structures Limited, dream it, we build it. Fortune City Estate, our house, our fortune. JL Properties, the city's favorite developer, the Greens Redefining Living, and DBS Roofing, Roofing Papa Party. To sponsor or exhibit your product and services during the fair, contact 0243 859 367 or 0540 123 799. The numbers again 0243 859 367 or 0540 123 799. Join News Habitat Fair 2018, affordable housing for all. Lisa Frick Ghana Limited, Ghana's leading leasing company, has just rebranded its car rental service. Switch is the new latest addition to the list of services by Lisa Frick. Switch offers affordability, excellent services, a wide range of vehicles, and defensively oriented professional chauffeurs. Call Switch Car Rentals for daily rentals airport transfers, cross-border and intercity travels. The vehicles include saloon cars, SUVs, buses and pickups. Rent any SUV and get free Wi-Fi access for entire rental period. Period. I beg your pardon. You also have a self and chauffeur drive options. Call Switch on 0501 282 269 or 0501 
082-282-271. Visit their website on www.switchcarrentals.com. Download their mobile app on Switch Car Rental on your Google Play or App Store. Switch Car Rental, you're better with us. Accra Academy is calling all Blau B to its annual homecoming, which is the biggest event on the Blau calendar. This year's Accra homecoming is recharged, revised and revamped and it's happening at the Accra campus on Saturday 11th August 2018 from 9am. Programs lined up include Blau Group's Roll Call, Inter Blau Group's Ojek Competition and many more. Do you own or run a business? They'll help you promote it while they contribute towards your alma mater happening on Saturday, 11th August 2018 from 9 a.m. After party will be right there on campus with free with fireworks and live band music. There'll be lots of food to eat and drinks. Blobby Homecoming 2018. It's classy, trendy and reloaded and it's happening on Saturday, 11th August 2018 from 9 a.m. and it will be streamed live on the internet. A young lady, a young lady is looking for a single room self-contained apartment around Adabraka, Asylum Down and Pig Farm. Landlords and caretakers may contact her on 0244-879-970 or 0268-923-746. The number is again 0244-879-970 or 0268-923-746. Seven four six. End of announcement, Sammy. Many thanks, Noella. All right, it's just about uh, 24 minutes away from midday. It's the Cosmopolitan Mix. Time to get into the Lifestyle Cafe brought to us courtesy Acacia. We place value on those you value as well as OnePlex 400, your one-stop duema for the entire family. I want to give you signs to take note when your boss is actually hitting on you. Now, if you are blessed with a great boss who genuinely wants to see you grow in your position and move to higher heights, then you can count yourself lucky. It's not always that we work for organizations where the boss is a nice person. Now, some bosses throw the little ounce of professionalism left in them out of the window. They forget that it's a work environment and start making advances at female colleagues leagues now how have you been i mean how if you've been in that position how have you dealt with it now the special cosmo production tiger eye team has come up with some pointers on how to know that your boss is hitting on you number one too many private meetings he will constantly plan meetings for things that don't even require a meeting or something he could have easily said over the phone uh, the so-called meeting is just an excuse to see you in private more often. Number two, he gives you work late or asks you to stay a little bit longer after working hours. Interesting. Number three, he favors you compared to other employees. That should be a, a normal thing. <laughs> Number four, he values your opinions more. Now, you could be in a boardroom not making much sense in whatever you are saying, and he could still say, yes, I agree with you. <laughs> now, he offers you gifts. Now, bringing you perfume after a Dubai trip, hmm, he probably fancies you. Now, he tells you his personal problems. He alone has problems more than the economy. Uh, he will tell you all that there is, personal issues, life, and probably uh, a whole lot more. And that all goes to show that he fancies you. And to the very last tip, he wants to take you out to lunch or dinner outside of work. Probably somewhere quiet away from prying eyes of your work colleagues as well. So those are the couple of pointers. Thanks to our Cosmo Tiger Eye team giving you a science to note if your boss is hitting on you. A big thank you to Acacia giving us the Lifestyle Cafe. Don't forget, Acacia is the number one insurance policy you should have for your workers. Acacia provides your staff with great customer service, quick payment on claims, IT support, quick service, and coverage in all the 10 regions of the country. Give your business what it needs with the number one health insurance provider, Acacia. Acacia will place value on those you value. A big thank you as well to OnePlex 400, your one one stop dilemma for the entire family. More questions coming in for Medical and Sister Derby. I get to them pretty shortly.
That's uh, Pure Water, that's Sister Derby, uh, features a fear, Pure Water. Why would you do a song and call it Pure Water? Pure Water. We can all relate to Pure Water in West Africa. Uh Uh-huh. Yes, and the song is for children and for maternal distance. For Uh nursing mothers. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> yeah, they are, they are telling the, the babies how to drink them. Because I saw a couple of you know videos <laughs> on Instagram. I think you are you are teaching this white lady how to drink pure water. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so we all know that you know in our part of the world, um, we drink water mainly in plastic sachets, mm-hmm. water sachets, and we refer to it as pure, pure water. water. And um, you are just telling your partner to drink you the way he drinks or she drinks pure water. I see. Mm, so when wifey comes back, tell her that, oh, drink me like pure water. <laughs> 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 and how was it like working with the fear on this one? Um, okay, we're not in the studio at the same time. So I'd done the song and I knew I wanted a feature. Like I knew I wanted something. And I had said earlier that year, I mean this year, that I wanted to feature more females, like more girls. And um, I went to One Love's Place where I'd been recording and... Mm. He was playing a song and I was like, oh, who is that? He said, oh, Ifia is some mature rapper song. I'm like, oh, can Ifia drop a verse for me? Can you ask her, please? He's like, oh, sure, he'll do that. So I was just there when my brother sent me, you know, the arrangements with Ifia's voice on it. Okay. That's how I got it. Okay, yes. I see. Interesting. Mm-hmm. All right, so now we want to check out, you know, a few things, you know, from medical. Medical, you, you said you know how to cook, right? Yeah. So take us through the process of oh, making. That one, yeah. Wait, wait, wait! <laughs> Let's be finish. Okay. Take us through the process of making jollof, Ghanaian jollof. You know, there, there's a saying. My my, they, my mom always tells me that a good chef mm-hmm. always doesn't share the secret mm-hmm. ingredients or secret. There's, there's, uh, hey, secret, <laughs> secret, yeah, hey, go on. Oh, no, 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 no. Epic please, finish. so record. I don't this. want me to know my method because uh, it be, you know, it be coded. So me, my own, I don't go fit talk. Um, I beg you. I don't I go like sham. Um, I would like to show you. How to make, how to make, how to, to make, okay, you simple. Let's, let's bring it down to, to, mm-hmm. to the barest minimum. Okay. How to make chicken stew. Oh, Charlie. That one cry hard past the Jollo for Chicken stew, they are type, so. Hey! <laughs> Romanian <laughs> type. Oh, your are type, mm-hmm. Like, your Belgian, your, Belgian your, type. Your chicken fillet. Hey! Sir? Yeah. Boneless what she chicken. order? Fish I will walk you through, hey. but you know. Boneless like, chicken fillet. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. Please. <laughs> Sammy, <laughs> fillet, fillet already means boneless, so you can't say boneless chicken yeah. fillet. Oh, you do allow. It's my show. <laughs> 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 uh, oh, Charlie, you see, you make a bar. Okay, so, 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 so take us through the, the chicken fillet. Sammy, hey. me, no. I'm not going to fill it. I'm fillet chicken. If I did do them, um, I go feel they do them. Um, but I don't know how. I don't know unless I did the kitchen with the things there and things. For oh, medical. Yeah. Yeah. So you don't know how to cook. Oh, I know how to cook. So take us through the process. That's the problem. Unless I'm doing it. Unless I'm in okay, the Okay, so, so what are your ingredients? Oh, of course you have to buy a chicken. 
<laughs> you need to get chicken. You have to get some, you know, oil, you know, mm-hmm. some sauce. Why they look at them? <laughs> no, I, I, you do have what has been there with them. Why you have to go? Why you have to go by that? Bring the cookie down. Okay, uh huh. Yeah, so you know, get everything, and everything. But you yourself, why? <laughs> ah. I, I'm a musician. I'm a chef. I'm done with that, chef. We'll start. Oh. We'll start in our house. Oh. No, she said you. For higher chef. She said she said you know how to cook. So. Oh yeah, but I know be giddy giddy like that. <laughs> they come. My rice and my stew really. I know how to go about. So that. the stew, no, it be the process, no. But why? Why you want to make me at some process? I, I don't know if it is Please, Sammy, can you eat raw tin tomatoes? Can you, why? you personally? Can you? I haven't answer? tried that. You haven't tried. Okay, no. okay, okay, okay. Why? Is that what you have been <laughs> eating? Medical cookies for you. <laughs> okay. A lot of questions coming. Let me get to a few. Uh, Ajiman Joseph in Community Night Tema says, enjoying the show um, as always. Wanya says, um, ask them both why Sister Debbie is louder than medical. Is it that medical is not eloquent? <laughs> <laughs> That's even. Medica is loud on stage where he has to be loud. Poof, poof, <laughs> swag. Okay. Medica, what school did you go to? Um, a dog easy. I, I a went dog to St. John's um, Rect Academy, um, SHS, where I go, a dog on. A dog easy. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I go IPMC. I go. Steady German. IPMC. Mm-hmm. What did you do there? <laughs> oh, IPMC and your computer, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Tell me, and you have too <laughs> many things so in common. Me too. Uh, uh, IT, you know. Oh, okay. IPMC okay. too. Okay. You know? okay. Yeah. Okay. So, so. If we swap places more. <laughs> 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 All right, so so you would say your your what? Uh, what did you do at IPMC specifically? Me, I know really finished the school because okay, yeah, some I was having, I was facing challenges in paying the fees and someone or two. I was going through someone or two, so I know if you complete. But obviously, as I go and study, teach we. Okay. You know, if you go to PC lab first, then things and study teach. Yeah, so yeah, that be where I, I, I go go to, I went I went to learn German. Oh, okay. A little bit of German because I wanted to go and continue my education in Germany. So okay, yeah, it is. I so boneless it. chicken in German is what? Ah, it's rice nish. I I don't know. It's what rice nish. That's I don't know. I don't right. know. Yeah, Even no. if he's lying, crap, we don't know. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, okay, ask medical to choose between. Can sack and shatter. Uh, I know go fit. Know go okay, fit. medical and sack. They should make a joint album. Do you think that's possible? Yeah, that would be dope. Yeah, that'd be, that'd yeah. Be AMG should forget about the age difference. Um, is it what Minaya is older than Muntari, but uh, big me up on your next song. That's Osman Larry. Hey, shouts to Osman Larry. Live, live, live. Okay, uh, one here says, um, "Hello, I'm Kofi from Santa Maria." Uh, please ask medical um, his relationship with TFK and Richie R- well, Rhymes or Rims or um, why did they beef in the first place and when are they setting se- settling the beef? I better go medical make you not talk say he no know them. <laughs> <laughs> Who are those? <laughs> because I don't know them. You don't know them. No. Okay. All right. So you can't beef with somebody you do not know. You understand. Okay. All right. So um, let, let me get down to a few things as well. Let me ask you guys. Cheating in a relationship, has it ever come up between the two of you? No, not really. Mm. Which one is there? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> not true. Really. Not at all. Have you cheated before? No. Have you cheated before? Nope. Okay. Interesting. When are you doing the do? When are you proposing to? That one, I don't know. Uh, I actually feel it, it, it will come naturally. But yeah. yeah. Okay. Ama says he could not afford school fees, but now he's rich. That he can even buy buy a, a school. <laughs> Charlie, I don't go fit by school. You go fit? Yeah. Or computer <laughs> school. Unless I check, I call a computer school. There are school. different types of school. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. What makes you sad? Um... <laughs> I don't know. I make sad chair, Papa. To be sad and then to That's be That's a like, good thing. Yeah, say, be be happy. I chair, I don't know if you make sad. Nothing about me. 
So I don't know. Right now, I don't know what what you make. I make sad. Unless maybe I don't know. I don't know. What about you, David? What makes you sad? Sorry, I was busy doing. <laughs> you always have this happy-go-lucky kind of look. You know, yeah. So what makes you sad? And what makes me sad? I don't know. I don't think I... Oh, what makes me sad? Okay, I know what makes me sad. When I see... When I see um, people in, like, extreme poverty. Or when I see animals suffering. Mm. When I see suffering of, like, living things. It makes me it sad. It makes you sad. Yes, I can even shed a tear. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's it. Let's talk the music industry. What makes you angry in this industry? What annoys you about Ghana showbiz? Um, I don't know about uh, the the what, what did the column say? The unity no really did there, uh, and a lot of people are very fake. Like they pretend like that. This that that I later go chat a lot a lot a lot about you to other people, say stuff negative stuff about you. You get me? It's mm. very bad. It's it's it makes me very angry. You get me a lot of fakers in the industry, and the unity is not there. Everyone is it's like it's a competition. Everybody for. Would one. you say you have friends in the industry? Yeah, I do. I have I, I, I have a few friends that I talk to. We vibe anytime we meet and all. You get me. But that one self, you know, really they talk like all the time, like me and my team. But that's apart from that, the industry is cool. It's calm. Mm. Yeah. Sister Derby, mm-hmm. what makes you upset about this industry? Okay, so you know how our society always tells us to be yourself. But mm-hmm. then when you are yourself, because people are not used to someone being a certain way, they they don't accept you really for who you are. Like I can go on some T V interviews and you know, express myself fully, maybe with some fooling or some laughter. I wouldn't even say anything profane. But because they haven't seen some of that before, they would edit it out or cut it out. Mm. Say, hey, this one, we don't do this here. So it just makes you, basically, your real self and your true self, when you are that way, you are not appreciated because it, we are not brought up that way here to be yourself or mm-hmm. to be able to express yourself fully. We are brought up to be timid. You don't talk to adults. You don't answer questions, that kind of thing. So when you are fully honest in yourself, people don't know how to handle it. So basically, I don't like the fact that like true talent, originality, and creativity is not appreciated. Mm. Rather, when you copy something, they look at, wow, how good you copied it because they want to see that a foreigner has done it before. If you do something fresh and new, it's not appreciated. Mm. Now, you once did say in an interview, I can't quote the exact words, okay. uh, but you said something like you don't believe in God. No, I didn't say I don't believe in God. Um, a lady asked me, what do I think happens after death? And okay. I just said to her that I don't believe there's anything after death. And I think the conversation went on to talk about heaven or hell. And I said I didn't believe there was a heaven or hell. Mm. So basically what I believe is that you can have hell on earth and heaven on earth. It's about how you carry yourself, your, you know, how you think, whether it's positive or negative. I feel like we've been given one life. And we have to make use of it. That is guaranteed. You can see it. You can feel it. Okay. But don't put all your hopes. Don't live a bad life hoping for something after. Okay. And I just said, I believe that when you die, you feel what you felt before you were conceived, which is what? Nothing. Okay. Yes. I mean, growing up, I used to think there was purgatory and heaven and hell. And you used to put all these scary like pictures and images in my head. I actually used to paint these kind of images. But growing up, I realized that, you know, all those things are put in place to discipline us and help us live, you know, a righteous life. But I don't believe in believing in something after life because Mm. I feel like, that's why we always say you have one life to live. You have one life to live. Life is very precious. I feel like we have to do everything we can here and now while we have it. Okay. All right. So you're not a Christian. Oh, as as now, I'm not a Christian. So what do you believe in? Oh, I just believe in humanity and like being a good person, living positive, like not harming anybody. I believe okay. that yeah, we all know what is good and what is bad. But mm. I still know that there are good people naturally and there are evil people. There are always going to be the sheep and there's always going to be the wolf. So you just decide which, which, parts, which side you are on. And what does yeah. your father make of what you believe in now? 
Oh, we haven't had that conversation, but he knows I'm not into religion. He definitely, it's, it's obvious because I don't go to church. I'm okay. not into religion at all. I'm not into any religion. Okay. Medical, what about you? Uh, I'm, I'm a Christian, actually. Okay. And yeah. you go to church frequently? Yeah, sometimes, w- yeah. What do you fellowship? Um, <laughs> do, you know, do, you know, do you know what I was about, about to say, Tyler Rip? Paradise Way, yeah. Paradise Way. <laughs> wow. Are you weak me? <laughs> if I know she's uh, well Wow. You weak me. Uh. Oh, what What would you say has been, I mean, let me big you up on what you did for your fans, you know, driving them around, taking them on shopping and all mm-hmm. that. I think that's really, really cool. Thumbs up, you know, on that. What is your worst encounter with a fan? Um, there was this one time I was, I, I was done with a show. I think it was, um, um, Takrade, Takrade, and then um, this fan came. He wanted to talk to me. It, it, it wasn't. It was. He not do him intentionally, but he not do him intentionally. He wanted to talk to me, and then he almost kissed me. Wow. <laughs> like, Yo, man, go, uh, 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 <laughs> chill. Yeah, that's 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 something. But it's cool. Your it's love. love. Some people are very, you know, when they see you, they don't know how to co- control themselves. Yeah, it'd be like me if I see somebody like Drake or something, I might flip out and something. So it's calm. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sister Debbie, what yes. about you? What's your worst um, encounter with the fan? Honestly, I, I don't think there's. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to say. But they always try to. The boys always try to kiss me, but I swear mm. it. But um, that won't be the worst. No, I mean that's not. That's actually funny. Okay. It's, it doesn't mean you're trying to kiss me. <laughs> but um, I don't like it if like your armpit is very sweaty mm. and fiery, so and that, you rab it on my go shoulder, and you dead. rub it on my shoulder. Yeah. That's the only thing that <laughs> scares me. But you just have to take it cool, you know, you and smile and color. take the picture. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I can't remember any very bad experience. Yeah, no, yeah. No, I don't, I can't remember. Well, I want to thank you both for taking time off to join us right here on the show. I appreciate it so much. Thanks and for um, amazing. Us. What, 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 do, what do you want to tell your fans out there? You know, yo, shouts to first any, of all. Any, any musics. Oh, <laughs> a lot of or, music they oh, come. Oh, then I'll red sweaters for you. Uh, Charlie, <laughs> I did drop EP before the year ends. Shouts to Attitude, shouts to Dance God, shouts to Flo Deli, shouts to Joy, shouts to Sammy Forcing for bringing me here. God bless you. I always come. Through. And FIFA, the FIFA year. Forget yourself. I go no oh, FIFA. Oh, if you score me, I go cook you your loss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, all right. And boneless chicken. <laughs> okay. You say me what? Uh, filet. Chicken yeah. filling. Chicken filling. I'm going too. to say fee. <laughs> 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 Sister Derby. Yes. Any message to your fans out there? Um, August is my birthday month. Me too. Yes. A week from today is my birthday. Hey. I was going to say, no, I'm not going to say happy birthday in advance because in Romania, even though we are not in Romania, it's it's forbidden to wish someone before oh, their birthday. Awesome. But in Ghana, we always do it. Happy birthday. Charlie, you say <laughs> anything, you know. Yes, and then as I said, I'm doing a free show for all my dolphins. Dolphins? Dolphins okay. are my fans, yes. All my dolphins, free show at Carbon on the 23rd of August, Thursday night, live band show with three new artists. Come through, and then if you haven't seen the Pure Water video, it's on YouTube, check it out. Also check out Medical's How Much video. His, that song is one of my favorite at the moment mm. as well. Swag, and swag. Um, there's going to be more music, more collabs, more music nice. videos. So just stay tuned for that. Okay. Many thanks, Medical, and of course, Sister Derby for joining us right here on the Cosmopolitan Mix. A big thank you to the entire social media team as well. Big thank you to Philip Nye, my producer. I'm making way for the midday news with MFR Apow. My name is Sammy Forsen. Catch me later on this evening at 8 p.m. on The Overdrive right here on Joy 99.7. EMG Business. By hat, boy.